Welcome back to that other stage that's also in Sonic Mania, Metallic Madness. Yay! Metallic I like Madness. That. It's much worse than the Sonic Mania version, though. I do not like Aww. this stage. What was that hitbox? The, the, you know. the first stage, the first act is fine. The second act goes on for way too long. You, you see, you see, this is the, this is what makes these commentaries fun for Carrie. She uh, recognizes it from Sonic Mania because that's the yeah. that's the commentary that committed to memory better. Also, she wasn't here for Sonic City, so that's the other awesome. thing. Yeah. So the reason I remember the Sonic Mania one better is because I was actually there for the Sonic Mania one. Yeah, yeah. All three of our playthroughs for it. Mm -hmm. Yes, I certainly I like have a large joke, but to fuck you over I think it's a good game, game though. So. Yeah. <laughs> A command grab. Command grab. Command Forward grab. Aerial. I don't have a grab key on my it's, keyboard. Now it's Sonic's bars. You know what the best thing is too know. about the Sonic Mania soundtrack being released on Spotify? What? So for a long time, the the lyrics in uh, Sonic Mania for um, oh my god, Mania yeah, were like people were like just doing hearsay, and there's actually a really good video of someone like getting it really close, pretty much to what it is. Yeah. And then and then they released on Spotify, and people were like. I was completely wrong about this verse, or like, I heard this completely wrong, and I can't believe it's this. You see, I think that's funny because uh, I apparently read some dangerously close to accurate lyrics from way before that release, and so when I finally did read the actual ones, I'm like, yeah, that's kind of what I thought it was already. <laughs> yeah. Alright, there's the generator. More like the deaderator. Deaderator. The deadrator. Dedge. That's actually another emote. Unfortunately, dead isn't very dead. funny, but death is funny. Dead is not funny, but dead is, is very funny. funny. <laughs> hey, Will. When you dodge, like it's the, really good. I hey, like Will. all those battle bots kind yeah. of wandering around. Oh my god, we talked about this. <laughs> <laughs> we're bringing it back. <laughs> oh, we are. We are. We're bringing it back. It never left, baby. It never left. <laughs> it never left. You may already be a winner. <laughs> I don't know, Gabe, just the way you were talking there just made me think of Kanjin. And you never will. He just has, like, a very specific cadence in his voice, you know? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Dude, go to the goal. Oh my god, he did. <laughs> <laughs> I can't fucking believe Bad it. Man. You already know who Sonic it is. Sonic made a good future. What's M? Sonic made a good future. <laughs> Give me M. Give me you. <laughs> give me M. Give me you. Alright, now time for him to start hitting the Yonky Splunky on the spring. <laughs> yeah, as one does. Carrie knows what the Yonky Splunky is. Carrie does like know what the Yonky Splunky is. Yonky Splunky sounds like, a, like what British move. people call a specific style of egg. Well, oh. then, have a bit of a Yonky Splunky this morning. <laughs> okay, Wait, okay, okay, you see, egg do you, you see. That <laughs> You see, that's that's that that's probably better. What I was imagining was a British sexual euphemism. Oh, uh, I can also work. Right, here. right, love. Tonight we're gonna try the yonky splunky. Oh, yonky splunky. That's not Show Australian. Show your sponge, love. Oh, that's actually yeah. gross. <laughs> it's because so, I'm actually okay. Australian, and I uh, um I just do a really good American accent. Oh, crazy, really. You know, yeah, your American accent's very convincing. I yeah. would have guessed you were American. Yeah. Hey Will, well, what, since you're Australian, you obviously know what I talk about when I say rack their decks, right? Mm-hmm. Nice. I'm not here to fuck spiders. <laughs> <laughs> okay, damn. Typical Australian L. Typical Australian L. There are Loses plenty of spiders in Australia. Because yeah, none, one... of, none of them are for fucking. Yeah. No, no. Unless they're, if you know what's good for uh, you. Unless they're um, super yeah, anthropomorphized okay. to the point where they're no longer spiders, they're just spider by name. They're In Australia, spiders. we only fuck kangaroos. <sighs> Crikey, I hopped in her pouch. <laughs> Don't say <laughs> that. Oh, wait a sec, that actually works. <laughs> it's a euphemism. <laughs> uh, okay. Okay. That actually works. It. Holy fucking shit. Australia, if you're listening, the entire country, start using that. Dear Australia. <laughs> Use this funny slang I came up with from an yeah. American. Yeah, of course. I How mean, that works. Yeah. <clears throat> you know, that's just... There are way too many... Sex, there, like, no, there's not enough sexual euphemisms on this show. I'm sorry. 
I, I don't Whoa. care how don't many. Enough. Enough. I don't we care. We make more. I don't care well, how many hemshed variations of having sex there are. We need more of them. <laughs> My guy said, "Not enough ham fuck." Not. <laughs> oh gosh, I feel like half of our ham chat dictionary is just words for having sex. Okay, Whoa. well let's get the ham chat dictionary up. Actually, let's see Whoa. how many there are. Oh, oh yeah, wait, I have I have it pinned. It should be pinned. I have it open. General. I already opened it. Um, okay, good. Okay, okay. So uh, first off, first off is ham bone. Yep. Um, ham fuck. Yep. That's pretty simple. He, he's only my mind you doing only the ones that are for having sex and not just the, the kind of general yeah. sexual. Yeah. These are all of them. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Ham ram. No, more where this came from. Yeah. Okay. So ham bone, ham fuck, ham ram, ham ream, ham smash. Okay. Uh, there's ham suki, ham suck, which is for blowjob. Yep. <laughs> um. Knock knock. Knock knock. Yes, I made that one up. I'm proud of that one. That's a very good one. Knock knock someone up. Oh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Knock, knock, it's knock. No coochie when a female will not engage sexually with you, or according to Will, no PP based friction time. <laughs> no PP no based what? Friction time. Friction time. <laughs> yeah, that's what you said. Dude, I, I love forgetting all of the jokes I've made so that, like, it's like, it's like I'm making the jokes at me. <laughs> yes. <laughs> It's a very good time. Very Wait, good time. You just like fucking disappeared for a second. Yeah. I still, I still love how like the shrink ray turns you into like a goddamn continue icon. <laughs> <That's funny. sighs> All right. Your continue icon is actually a confirmed character. Yeah. <laughs> it's called Continue Sonic. He's got a command grab Chronic and everything. For short. Chronic actually. Chronic. Yeah. How, how does this shake up the meta, Gib? Uh, well, Sakurai didn't want to add in a smaller Sonic, so unfortunately, mm -hmm. while I would give an opinion, he's just kind of one of those things like Spyro or Shovel Knight, where like we can only kind of like. Okay. I yeah, mean, Shovel Knight's pretty easy because he's an assist, so you can gleam a good amount of his move set. But you know, as for like Spyro, you can kind of pick and choose. Save you know, the like now I respect Sakurai's wishes and all. He's my father, after all. <laughs> Please. Yes. Yes. You see, I like that because this is the final act of Metallic Madness and therefore the final stage in the game. So right before the final boss, you just have that one-up that respawns infinitely. It's also all happy and shit. And look at the fucking colors and there's water. There's a nice prosperous city in the background. Yeah. Uh, see the lives for which I laid down my lives. Yeah, Peaceful, prosperous, and happy. In the bad future, it looks a lot worse. <laughs> Yeah, good thing we're in the good future. future. Looks objectively bad. <laughs> yeah. You know what? It actually, like, yeah. It looks like where I live. Oh. Wow. Just kidding. Actually, where I live is a very nice nature nature area. It's because nobody lives. That's true. Where? He said bleep. <laughs> Thank you. Do you actually want me to cut out the state? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Y yes. Cut okay. out the country. <laughs> You know, just cut Will out of the commentary. <laughs> just every time I say anything, you refer to me. Okay, but no, actually, actually, do you want me to cut out the state there? Yeah, yeah. Yes? Okay. I'm from Arizona. Damn, um, Carrie, what's it like oh, in also, I, Arizona City? Um, I no longer have pronouns. Just don't refer to me. Right. I won't even mention the person who is here. Because here we go, we got the opera in the background. Here we go. Fucking Ooh. Final Fever. And then in the Time American the version, juice. it's just the same old regular ass nightmare boss theme that the American soundtrack has for some reason. Super cool that they decided to traumatize kids like <laughs> And then the How game over theme is just as bad. Oh, no. no. The game over theme is not okay. You like would the think evil laughing and the huh. terrifying music I can get behind. The game over one. No. Okay, okay, but here's the thing, here's the thing, as, like, fucking weird and, like, creepy the boss theme is in the American soundtrack, it at least does fit better with that secret screen than, uh, the Japanese one does. Yeah. Well, I mean, the Japanese one, I feel like, was meant to be taken as a joke. Yeah. Whereas, 
it the says American fun one is, is infinite sega enterprises yeah the, the you know the the one in you know americans like if you have pirated this game you are going to die tonight well it's not it's not an anti-piracy screen it's uh it's just a screen that pops up when you enter a certain code in the sound test and there's like four other images that meet that, meet that qualification i thought the gimmick was that it popped up if you would have pirated the game i mean that might have also been its use, but that's where you find it in the regular ass game. I don't actually know. Yeah. Didn't you have to add any sound effects too? Uh. So. Um. Okay. So yeah, that's actually the thing. The version of the ending that is used in the Origins version of Sonic CD is the faster paced. Uh, is the faster paced version that just has the music playing that was originally located in um, Sonic Jam. Yeah. And is the most common version of it. Uh, this is the result of uh, finding the video via a Steam mod that someone made to uh, restore the original version alongside the uh, actual restored animation from the uh, from the Origins version. Nice. So, because like, modders. actually, I do want to bring that up. The, uh, the animation um, by Toei here. Uh, this is the cleanest it has ever looked, and they actually brought in Discotech to do it. Really? Yes. Crazy. Yeah, Discotech, uh, touched up, like, completely restored the, uh, original animation for Sonic CD, and it looks better than it ever has before as a result. Yeah. All right, um, but yeah, that's, uh... That's Sonic CD for the, the second time. Um, I definitely have enjoyed this commentary more than the first one. The first one, the only joke of note was that one point where we were all like, Sonic does not love you. Sonic does not, Amy, Sonic does not love you. Because <laughs> that originally spawned from um, uh, Game Club. Yeah. I love how Sonic just made the enemy shoot himself. <laughs> he did. He said, you will die by your own hands. <laughs> by your own blaster. What are those guys doing? <laughs> They're just <laughs> having a good time. <laughs> They're making flowers. Yeah. Oh. That is... This is, like, like one of the fucking coolest parts of the whole animation. Is the fucking, like, the, the bugs lighting the area every time they shoot. I'm like, it's so good. Bam. Super kills all of them. Dead on... And then the last dumped. shot we get is from the race. Yep. Sonic is a fan of racing. Just you know win the race! Just win the race! Just win, just win, just win the race! Will, do you know what it means when you're a fan of racing? Oh, hey, there's the Eggman statue I was talking about. I do, I do actually. Yeah. You're a racist. <laughs> <laughs> just like if you're a fan of Terraria, you're a terrorist. <laughs> and if you're a fan of Dry Bones, you're a boner. <laughs> yep. <laughs> <laughs> what if you're oh. <laughs> oh man I love those pictures <laughs> I um I love the sending theme it's called Cosmic Eternity I love you oh thanks Will Will yeah you're respected you're respected <laughs> <laughs> Feels good. <laughs> Feels good, man. All right. Carrie? Hi. You're all right. Aw, thanks. Sorry I haven't said much. Sometimes it's hard <laughs> to know what to say. <laughs> you, you guys are way, like, well, think way too good, quickly compared to me. My brain is too slow. Gabe, okay, it's called oh, the good ending! Look at, these, look at these flowers, Carrie. You're That's too cool, cool. Carrie. Oh. Yeah. You We're are all too cool. cool. Too cool? Uh-oh. That Presented like a by thing. Sega? No fucking way. Invented by Sega. That's Capcom the whole time. Are you kidding me? I mean, that's also Fuck true. This game. And here's some new animated footage to transition between games. Good thing Sonic had a plane nearby. Oh, yeah. yeah. Minion. He's just doing tarot cards by the lake. Yep. Hilarious. Quirky. Quirky Earthbound inspired RPG about depression. <laughs> See you next game! That game being Bro. Sonic 2, by the way, even though it came out before Sonic CD. We'll literally be seeing him next game, that's crazy. Next yeah. time on Smash Team Games, we're we playing, see Tails. Because we're playing next Sonic game. 3 and Tails. <laughs>